Hey, good morning, everyone. Here we are. Looking at Mount Vesuvius there. Used to be much taller than that. We are coming right into Naples. It's uh, just before 6.30 in the morning. Alright guys, well we're coming into Naples today, we're going to go <clears throat> up to the top of that, Mount Vesuvius. Hopefully the clouds will be gone, maybe we'll see some views from there. And then we'll go to Herculaneum. And then uh, I think friends want to shop in town, which uh, last time I came I didn't see anything that was good to go shopping for, but you know, each into their own I suppose. And I uh, hope you enjoy uh, today's video. Shaking and baking right now, coming into our uh, docking position in Naples. And there's a Norwegian Spirit, which we saw a couple days ago. Place on a hill there. Two of us is all getting ready. Huge chunks of pineapple here, which is really good. A good piece of the candle. Uh, looks like we're gonna have a balloon drop tonight. Thank you. Alright guys, here we go. So they got a pretty nice terminal here in Naples. And look at this uh, Cool mosaic uh, table they got going on here. And off we go to the uh, car rental spot. So we made it through the sea of uh, salespeople and tourist guides there. And over that way is the uh, Star Flyer. It's a uh, small, it's a large sailboat, but it's a small uh, uh, cruise vessel. The Star Clippers line. It's the Castle Nuovo. All right, so we just came from the port down there. If you don't know where the car rentals are, they're here in this building, and they got Hertz and Maggiore here, but they don't open until 8:30. So if you think you're gonna, you know, jump off the cruise ship at seven o'clock or as early as you arrive, uh, you're gonna waste time. So if you really want to get someplace early, you may want to take the bus or the uh, train. So we're waiting like five more minutes till they open up. All right, so now we're waiting for our uh, car rental. Took, we were first in line, so that was good. We're getting a Ford Focus today, and it was 186 euros to rent a damn Ford Focus for a day, which is a ripoff with my discount. Oh, this is diesel. She don't fuck it up. You gotta put diesel on there. This is our uh, Ford Focus for today. Boo! That's not us. Yes. <laughs> now see with me the car. So after a detour through some area we didn't even know, now we're finally getting on the uh, Auto Strada here. Get some change ready for the uh, thing. You get change? What? Oh, 
Nice view towards the uh, valley. It's not really a valley, I guess. I'm going through the uh, rainforest. <laughs> So here we are going up the uh, twisty road with all the cool switchbacks. We're getting closer up here to the top. So we're getting close. We've got a tour bus in front of us now. Some part of it behind us maybe. I think we have to pay to park uh, further up. So there's the rental car. We get to walk through the nice woods here. Beautiful fresh air this morning. It's not too hot. It's like 70 degrees right here. And I think it'll be colder uh, up at the summit as well. So it's five euros to park and then it's uh, I think one euro or two euros a person to take the shuttle up to the top. Tour buses just go straight. Alright, so we get out here, buy waters, whatever we want. I'm doing or no? And uh, buy more tickets in order for us to go up to the top there. And there's part of the crater down there. Alright, so we buy some tickets in here. Nice looking ticket office. Ten euros to go up. So today on the money account, uh, 186 euros for the car. Uh, we paid uh, five euros to park, uh, two euros a person for the round trip shuttle up to that point right there, and then another 10 euros a person in order for the privilege of walking up this uh, pretty steep hill here. And the tour buses get to go straight up to the top. Here's the local police. Right, so we made it up part way. They got, you know, rocks and shirts and the studio t-shirts and all that kind of stuff. Another souvenir shop here. See if they have a patch or something from... Alright, so they do have a bathroom here at the base, 50 euro cents. And this is where you give them your 10 euro ticket to go in. And keep walking up the hill. Grazie. 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 Alright, so let's run up this section, see if I can do it. Pretty steep. I only made it halfway up, I got tired. It's a long section. All 
All right, we're getting closer to the top here. Gorgeous views of the uh, Bay of Naples here. We got a little shop here. Just see these rocks there for sale. All right, we're getting close to the crater, it looks like. Can't get enough of the views here, huh? <laughs> well, we made it here to the crater. Uh, this is the main crater down in there. Alright, so that's cool. We saw the crater and, of course, more uh, beautiful views of the bay. And don't climb up in that area. We'll make our way up here to the uh, the top, I suppose. Maybe we'll be able to see down the Amalfi Coast a bit from here. Get another shot into the crater. So I don't know if you can see it from down there. It's a little bit uh, hazy today, but that's the Amalfi Coast into the Sorrento area and that type of thing. And of course, we got more views into the bay as well. Another shot down the crater, so we got one last section to go. Almost looks like the uh, with the haze, the sea and the sky just kind of meet in the middle there. You don't know where it ends. It's almost like the boats are coming in from the from the sky. Several steps. on the uh, back side of the crater look at that it's like almost straight down into there. Here's a 360 degree shot for you. Down into the crater of course. And we'll go back over there. Alright so I made it to the end I got another shot here. It keeps going even more, it looks like, but I don't think I'm going to do that. I think my friends want to go back. I think that's for the tour buses. So you can go down the back side of the mountain, I guess, and turn on the tour buses. Alright, so I forgot to time it at the top. It's, uh, 10.59 right now and I'm on my way back and I walked all the way around there to the uh, last hut. So I'm now on our way back. Don't know where my friends are but I'm thinking they got tired of walking and they're waiting there or they went back down the hill. A little shrine here. They're leaving a lot of money there too. Huh? I made it up all the way around the crater. Now uh, Going to make our way back down the hill. I think I saw my friends there down around the corner. Could be wrong about that. But uh, I think that was worth the view. You just gotta realize it's uh, it's a steep hike up loose gravel, so you probably need good, you know, hikers, something like that. And uh, it's a good workout. Long way down, but nice views as well. All right, we made it back down to the uh, bottom. And of course they tell us Arrivederci at the end of the sign. Oh, there we go, I got my climber <laughs> man in the photo. <laughs> Interesting little junk shops in here. Oh, my God.
some wine, Vesuvio wine, ice cream. If they have anything interesting here, patches. Oh, sorry. The lava magnets. And have a glass of the local uh, wine, Vesuvio, right. red wine, all right? Vino Rosso. Vino Rosso, guys. Vino Rosso. Lava Rico Fuoco. Quando è molto? A molto, a molto. Caffè, lo zucchero. Vino Rosso. Vino Rosso. Vino Ah, eh, ti dico. Ah, là. Si guarda in amarillo. 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 Si Bye-bye. All right, got my glass of uh, Vesuvio red wine here. Show you my son. Arrivederci. Ciao. Hi, guys, we are out of here. Want to say hello? Say hello. Hi, guys. Hi. All right, we're out of here. We're off the bus. Now we're going to go to uh, Herculaneum.